This is the Motive XS. This is the XS7. Next to me we have the 6 and the 8 with the balanced hammer keyboard. And this is a brand new piano sound. Why does it sound so great? Well, I'm going to explain it to you later. First of all, we're going to take a look at the machine because there are so many new things here. First of all, 8 faders, 8 knobs, a huge color display only to improve the user interface of the machine. Loads and loads of presets. The wave ROM has increased an absolute top workstation. Like I said, a brand new piano. The voices can be built up until eight elements per voice. That's quite amazing. This piano also has eight elements, including key off sampling. And key off sampling makes it even more realistic to play. How can I show you this? Well, very easy. I just push edit, and then I'm gonna switch off all the elements except the key off sampling. So as soon as you start playing, you will hear the key off right there. Also, loads and loads of new, great electric pianos. I'm going to select an organ sound now. Why? Well, if I play, you will hear nothing. As soon as I open up the faders, you can hear eight elements opening up. Seven, eight. So, this is really very, very complete. Another great thing, loads and loads of controllers. I have this typical classical organ. And as soon as I open this up, I have this really crunchy sound. It's all right there. All the controllers in your reach. Very, very complete. Arpeggiators. There are more than 6,000 arpeggiators in this machine, including guitar arpeggiators. And the cool thing is, half of these arpeggiator patterns actually recognizing the chords that you are playing. So it will always try to make the voicings as smooth as possible. Beautiful acoustic guitars. It's just in the machine. So if I combine voices, we always get into a section called performance. Now I can say I have a piano, some electric piano and some strings on top of each other. The cool thing about this machine, like I said, more than 6,000 arpeggiator patterns divided in different useful categories. But in this machine, especially in Motif XS, you can run four arpeggiators at the same time. So I can have this piano and some drums and bass. It may sound like accompaniment, but it's not. This is all arpeggio based. So very, very nice. Wurlitzer pianos. You can hear some sort of a phasing effect on this. Well, the whole DSP processor of Motif XS has improved. Now we have the so-called VCM effects built in. They sound great, but they look and feel great. They really look sort of like plugins. Also here, I have the phaser effect built in. I can combine it with a nice groove. All that stuff. I can say I have some guitars. You can really hear. You hear all these all these arpeggiators running. Organ sound. Leslie. Groove. It's such an inspirational machine. I have some electro club here. And then I'm coming to a new feature called the performance control. As soon as I push performance control, I can control the four different voices inside this performance. For example, drums. Stuff like that. It's all about power. Dynamics. Always, it's always great. You can even play the old stuff, you know. As you can see, I'm changing the arpeggio pattern in real time, just like this. It's all in real time. Then I have this groove here. And then I get to another point, the direct performance recording. 
Imagine this, I have this great groove here in performance mode and I want to record it in a song or a pattern. What do you normally do? Well, in the old days, you had to copy all your sounds, all your effects, all your arpeggiators to your song or pattern. You don't have to do that anymore. What I can do now is I am in performance mode still, I like this thing, I push the record button, I select which pattern or how many bars, whatever, and I can immediately start recording. Only four bars, and it stops, and now he automatically copied it from my performance to my pattern. I'm gonna show that to you. I'm gonna go to the pattern, and I just push play, and it's there. That means I can now continue working on this, because I have, again, MIDI channel five till 16. So I go to channel number five, I have a house beat here. I'm gonna record this. How do I do that? Well, quantize. Why? Because it's house, of course. Three, four. It's in. So this is how fast you can actually record all this stuff. I'm going to show you something else. This machine also has a built-in vocoder. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to bring the microphone in. Don't try this at home. And as soon as I play now, you hear suddenly my voice through a vocoder. So I open up a bass line. Even continues because I also have a clavinet hooked up to one of these VCM effects, which has a pedal wah, and that means I have a wah wah here, so I can use the wah wah clavinet in exactly the same groove, like this. machine is so much fun. Using all these arpeggiator types, it's going to be such an inspiration to work with this workstation as a standalone. But you can also connect this machine to your computer. The machine will be delivered with a very special, very complete version of Cubase called Cubase AI. That's exactly what I brought here on my laptop. I'm going to show you now how easy it is to hook it up to your machine using the Motif XS editor, but also using the remote from the Motif to control your Cubase. So I connected Cubase AI here to my workstation using a very simple USB cable. If we take a look at the screen, you see the multi-editor straight away, all the 16 MIDI channels immediately to your availability. But also the voice editor is included in the same editor. You can download this editor for free from yamahasynth.com, gratis in Dutch, it's very important for us people. And then all the sounds can be edited directly and you're still inside your Cubase project. That means if you save your Cubase project, all these settings will be saved with it, which is called Studio Connections. There's another great advantage of this whole setting, the remote function from Motif. If I push this button, suddenly my transport function buttons and the faders become the controllers for my Cubase. I'm gonna show that to you. I'm going to a main screen right here, and if I push the play button, it starts running. The data wheel becomes my jog and shuttle wheel, as you can see. I can call up the mixer in real time, and as soon as I do that, my faders become the controllers for Cubase. So this is a very complete and very reliable setup. So let's summarize a little bit. What is this? It's a very complete workstation, the XS series. Loads of faders, loads of knobs, loads of real-time control. The color display is amazing. So many different sounds, so many ways to connect this machine to your computer or anything else. Up until one gigabyte of sampling. We have sounds built up up until eight elements per voice. We have four arpeggiators running simultaneously if we want to. So it cannot get any more complete than this. 